Hi guys, welcome back. Today is an extra large grocery shopping. Uh, we needed to stock up. We made it an extra week without going shopping, so we needed the essentials as well as the cabinet food. So I'm gonna show you what I purchased in my extra large shopping haul today. Enjoy! All right, here is an overall of my dining room table with all the items I did purchase. So let me show you what I got. So first to start off right here, this is my kid's favorite bread. This is the Martin's potato bread. Um, my grocery store gets their fresh bakery rolls delivered to the store. So if you go super early in the morning, you get them nice and hot. We got six large rolls over here. My kids love these rolls. I have a container, a half a pound of this bow tie pasta salad with sun-dried tomatoes, mozzarella, and basil. My daughter requested that. We have some Ken's honey balsamic dressing. We have an instant espresso coffee, the Cafe Bustiello. We have a Jif Creamy Peanut Butter because me and my husband love our protein shakes with peanut butter banana from the brand 310 which is plant based and has pea protein so this is great to go into our shakes. We have some extra creamy whipped cream, a small Kraft Parmesan cheese. We have I believe over here too we have two cans of corn, whole corn with a touch of sea salt. I picked up a small one because I haven't been using fabric softener that much so these are pretty cheap. These are the small blue swarvel ones. We have some yellow rice here for burritos. Needed some new measuring cups so picked it up. We got the full cup size as well as the teaspoon, tablespoon, and a quarter teaspoon so we got that. Got a liquid egg whites, which actually comes very in handy if you just want egg whites, which my husband loves. We have a cage-free brown uh, egg carton. We have five boxes of pasta. Barilla is our favorite. We have uh, two farfalli. We have a penne. Uh, this is like a mixed combination. I'm probably botching the name, but a musty yellow. We have a uh, mezzi rigatoni. We have some parsley back here because I do love to make pasta with olive oil, parsley, and cheese. Next we have some fresh blueberries which I enjoy for my breakfast. Uh, my yogurt, blueberries, and granola. I have two containers of grape tomatoes here underneath. A pre-cut cantaloupe. My seven-year-old loves cantaloupe. We have some green apples over here. We have five green apples. We have five gala apples. We have a whole big bag of green grapes. Five avocados, which was a great price. It was five for five. Favorite tea brand, the Perfect Peach Bigelow, the herbal tea, caffeine free, love this one. We have some Dole Juice pears in a cup. Next we have some shredded cheese, our favorite shredded cheese brand, the Sargentino. Um, this is the four cheese Mexican, so we have two of those. We have a fresh loaf of Italian bread that was just baked, it was nice and soft. This is the olive oil loaf. We have two bread and butter pickles that were on sale this week, an extra large package of frozen hash browns my toddler really enjoys, container of honey for tea, and also my granola yogurt. We have some feta cheese, which I'm going to be making for like the fifth time already, the feta cheese pasta with grape tomatoes, which we actually really enjoy. Some donuts back there. My son requested the mini ones. They didn't have the large ones. And we got five jars of the Prego Creamy Vodka. So this one actually is um, made with vegetables. It's gluten free and it's ve vegetarian. So I'm going to try that out. Then I got some organic coconut oil. 
to either cook with and also my toddler, my three-year-old, has been having like a patch of very dry scalp on her head. So I'm going to put a little bit of oil and let her sit on it to loosen it up. Um, we have two current apples back there for my toddler because she's been having a lot of bathroom problems and constipation. So I mix it with a little bit of water because um, she's not really a big juice drinker. We have some extra virgin olive oil in the back. Water family. We have six large Poland Spring waters. Favorite couscous is the Parmesan flavor. Another one of my favorite teas at nighttime, the Yogi Honey Lavender Stress Relief. Allergy friendly snack for my seven year old. This is Enjoy Life Soft Baked Coco Loco Chewy Bars. It's free from peanuts, wheat, tree nuts, dairy, soy, eggs, sesame, fish, mustard. So this is a good brand if you have any allergies. We have a large package of plastic silverware. We have some cheese over here. We have Swiss cheese, three quarters, three quarters cheddar cheese, a box of sugar. I uh, ran out of my Pam, it lasted forever, so I needed a new Pam. We have the low orange juice right here, low acid, some hazelnut coffee creamer. We have four milks back there. This is the lactose free organic from Horizon, which is really good um, for my toddler. And they don't expire fast, so I stock up when I see them. Some snacking chips for the husband, sweet and spicy jalapeno. Got a zucchini here because I do like to grade this up and sneak it into my son's noodles because he does not like vegetables, so I have to grate it and sneak it up without him knowing. We have a pre-cut banana nut muffin loaf cut. We have some spinach over here, which I do like to put in a sandwich or wraps, or my husband puts in eggs. Here's the other tomatoes for a feta cheese pasta this week. Some vanilla tea biscuits back here. The kids dino nuggets. They didn't have the regular panko this week, so I just got them the dino one. Then we have some red hot sweet chili dipping sauce. We have super soft pretzels. I have three boxes of cheese pizza bagels. My son. Necessity, honestly, necessity always have to have for his lunch. We have some Eggo thick and fluffy ones. This is a cinnamon brown sugar. We have some Spank Copita pies, spinach, cheese, and phyllo dough. And I love this brand, the Amy's. It's a vegetarian brand. Make yummy, yummy, healthy foods and clean. This is the pesto tortellini. We have two of these Chinese noodles with vegetables and a cashew creamy sauce, and they are plant-based. So these are good snacks, quick for me. We have also spinach uh, ravioli with some tomato sauce and ricotta. We have four of these ready-cooked crispy crinkles, microwavable, four minutes. So I got one, two, three, four. We got some Pringles over here. We got some silk almond milk, but I buy the vanilla unsweetened for my protein shakes or if I'm gonna have it with some granola. We have a half and half back there. We have our favorite crackers, the Townhouse Original Oval Shaped Crackers. Large honey bunches of oats, honey flavored, and some plain cornflakes. My husband actually has been loving cornflakes, but instead of sugar, he's been putting honey as an alternative, and he enjoys that. So we have bananas, because I have a bunch of monkeys here. So two big bundles of bananas. They most definitely will go. Me and my husband put in smoothies. If it doesn't get used, I will cut them, peel them, put them in the freezer. Next we have... Just two paper towels since I have a couple. Just wanted to make sure I had stock. And two bulbs of garlic. Like so one meal is going to be pasta with parsley, garlic, and olive oil for one bulb. The next bulb is going to be for the feta cheese tomato pasta. So that's done. Then we have two big crowns here of broccoli, which I like to cut my broccoli up. 
roast it with some olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic on 425 for about 15-20 minutes. And then I do like to cook up some white rice, so I make my own Chinese style takeout menu food thing. So yeah, that is my grocery haul for this week. Obviously a lot of it's frozen food, it's gonna stock up and we'll definitely eat through it. And when we run out of freezer food, we eat through the cabinet. So thank you guys so much for watching and staying tuned. If you haven't already, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell notification to be notified, and I'll catch everyone on my next video. Hope this gave you ideas. Bye. 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 Bye.